Welcome back to the vacation edition of the Switchbacks, Sulani Part 2. Uh, John and Ellie are on vacation with their family. Somebody's asleep on the couch. I think that's Bart. Yes, that's John's brother, Bart. They're also here with their daughter and their grandchildren. I'm not sure where all of those people are. Okay, the girls are in the, the ocean. Howard is in the ocean. I don't know where Eliza is, but she can't be too far away. The last time I saw her, she was fishing. She's not fishing now. Don't know where that kid is. That's okay. I'm sure her parents know exactly where she is. So John and Ellie are having a little bit of vacation sex. Nothing wrong with that. And after that, they're both going to hit the hay. They are both pretty tired. Hopefully this woohoo is a lot more exciting than the previous woohoos. That's what I'm hoping on. Okay, John's out, Ellie's out, awesome. And the extended family just keeps walking in and out of this door here. So that's awesome. So these are the four bungalow, oh, John, he's not asleep. He's gonna go to the bathroom, okay. Get John to use the toilet and then after that, hit the shower. Good. And I'll leave Ellie to what she's doing. I wanted to show you the back end of the bungalows. This is clearly, this is the pink one. It has just a couple of chairs and a light. This is the yellow one. It's a little bit, it should be the same size. It's not a little bit bigger. It just looks a little bit bigger. Somebody made some hamburgers or some chimmy. I don't know what chimmy is. Okay, it's a burger. It's a Dominican burger and Cameron is the one who made it, so that's awesome. But this is the yellow bungalow. It has a grill, picnic table. The blue one has a grill and a small table with a lot of bad food on it. Brother Bart is up and cleaning up. Pinchos are from Spain. Cool. Okay, that's uh, bar food, it said. The orange has just a couple of chairs, so the orange is pretty mild and the house is decorated for Thanksgiving I think I'm not sure but anyway John is embarrassed because the woohoo was not good ah oh, John he underperformed with the woohoo I think that the switchbacks have to woohoo a lot more so that they can you know up their game I mean these guys are killing it in their separate skills but in the woohoo department well it's <laughs> okay, Ellie is up and she really needs a shower, but John is in the shower. And if she were in her proper bungalow, she'd be able to take a bath. So if we can get Ellie to go over to, oh, wait, wait, wait. If they want to sleep in the pink one, that's fine. I forgot there's a tub downstairs. Ellie can take a bath in here, even though there are people in here. If she can shush her son-in-law and brother-in-law out of the bathroom, then the place is hers. Nope, can't do it. Okay, Ellie's going to go to another bungalow for a shower. Good, I'm going to let her sort it out. Let's see how John is. John's in the shower, and John's just about clean, and he's also really tired, so let's have him go to sleep. Don't fall asleep in the bathroom floor, John. Don't do it, John. Okay, good. All right, and Ellie is in the yellow bungalow, taking a quick shower. Cool beans. John's asleep. Let's check on the extended members again. We know that two of them are in the bungalow. We don't know where the girls are. That's okay. Sometimes being a grandparent is knowing when to stop looking for other people and just enjoy your vacation. So that is what they're doing. Boy, they must have gone home. I just don't see the Baker family. There's Howard in the bathroom and I'm not entirely sure what he's doing in there. What is he doing? Nobody washes their hands that much. Oh, he's playing with a, clay, a piece of clay. All right, whatever. So Howard's here. I don't know where Howard's wife and children are, but okay. 
Ellie is finished with the shower, so I think now is a good time. Oh, her energy is down. I wanted her to swim. Oh, there's Bella, and there are the girls. They're all in the bed. So Ellie can swim with Bart, except that Bart is now getting out of the water. This is frustrating. Good, okay. Ellie's gonna go swimming. She's tired, but I can have her sleep later. Oh, she's tired and hungry. I can't control this. Where is the good food? Okay, this looks like good food. So I'll get Ellie to eat first. I probably should just, should have just moved that. I goofed. And Ellie is on her way. Oh, cool. She's going to swim over to the bungalow. Which one is it, the blue one? Yeah, the blue bungalow. Go upstairs and grab that food. Okay, Ellie's gonna eat. And after she eats, it's probably a good idea to go to sleep. Howard's kind of having his vacation for one over there. That's fine. Okay, Ellie's chatting with her brother-in-law, who I think is in the, oh, okay, he's coming up now. She'll get to have a little bit of friendly time with him. I'm gonna get a close up of this food. It looks like this sort of shish kebab looking thing. It's Spanish. Okay, it originated in Spain. It's become part of Latin American culture. Pinchos can be found in bars, restaurants, as well as on street vendors. Cool. In Latin America, pinchos are made with a variety of proteins. A favorite is chicken with different spices and sauces. So, I thought Ellie was taking a picture with John, uh, with Bart, but where, why are they in two separate locations? Okay, that's strange. Ellie likes to travel by water, I respect that. Bart's uncomfortable taking a picture, I guess, so whatever, dude. Ellie has to use the bathroom and also sleep. And after she pees like a champion, she can sleep. Where is Bart going? I don't have control over Bart or most of the people in this on this vacation, but Bart's going to go to sleep. Uh, Bella is asleep, don't know where Howard is, the girls are asleep, and now Ellie is about to go to sleep. Oh, and she doesn't have paint on her face anymore, which is good. Okay. Ah, now everybody's, well, Howard went to sleep and then he got up again. And now I'm being voyeuristic because I don't have control over these people. I'm just watching him watch his wife, which is really uncomfortable. Okay, girls are up. Yes, both girls are up. Cameron's flirting with the idea of being sick. And it's Harvest Fest. Okay, oh, Cameron's really dirty. Okay, I'm going to let her handle her business. Ellie is asleep. She's not going to be asleep for much longer. And John has woke awaken hangry <laughs> all right use the toilet and then he can start working on some harvest fest things it's 
since John is in the pink bungalow, we'll just use that. And so now he can cook a grand meal and he'll make it a grand breakfast. That's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, the objectives for Harvest Fest are holiday gnomes to interact with them, cook the grand meal, and to demonstrate a thankful spirit. So John's quest to complete Harvest Fest on a positive note is going to be pretty easy. Ellie, because the, de the decorations are up and also she ignores this tradition, we don't have to worry about it. And so she's got holiday gnomes, she's got the grand meal, and she's got the thankful spirit as well. I'm not gonna bother Ellie, she needs a shower, but I'm gonna let her sleep it off and just enjoy John cooking this harvest meal. Okay, grand breakfast is cooked. Let's get everybody out to eat. And they can all have some fantastic family time. Yay, family. Good, looks like Ellie's up and on her way over to grab some food. And this bowl is leftovers. Cameron cooked it. I can't move it, so hopefully Cameron or somebody will come along and eat it or put it away. I don't know which. So Ellie's, where is Ellie? Who came over to the pink bungalow? Okay, that's Bella. Bella's grabbed something to eat. Ellie is on her way. We'll just see the family trickle in. Bella, uh, Ellie's got a nice, confident, energized walk, and so she's going to grab her grand meal, and John so far hasn't had, hasn't gotten credit for the grand meal. I guess that'll come when he finishes. All right. Well, family time. There's Eliza. I don't know where Cameron is. She must be around somewhere. So Bella's going to eat in the living room. Uncle Bart has taken his plate somewhere else. I don't know where Howard is. He's probably asleep, so I'm not going to worry about it. I am not going to worry about it. Who's she talking to? Oh, cool. Okay. So family's eating. Eliza's on the couch with her mom. John and Ellie are eating at the table and they're all having a great big chat. And I'm not seeing any gnomes. Shouldn't I be seeing gnomes by now? Okay, meal accomplished for John. Ellie's still eating so she's not going to get credit for that yet. And she's of course flirty. Good. Okay, so Ellie's gonna want to. I know she's flirty, but I'm more worried about Harvest Fest. So she's gonna be thankful, and John is going to be. Oh, hopefully, complain is not the only option here. Oh, he's also gonna be thankful. I mean, who wouldn't be thankful? Going on vacation with your family? That's great. Good. Okay, what other things? So John has finished Thanksgiving and so has Ellie. So now's the time to get out there and get some fitness going. Let's do some uh, outrigging. Is that what you say when you go on a boat and sail around? I don't know. Okay. Ellie's going to have some fun out in the sun, and John is going to also have fun, but I don't know where or how. 
Is that a second boat? Or I'm just turned around. Okay, Ellie. Is that Ellie? Yes, yeah, she swims with the sherp. Good. Ellie's going to do some boating and let's see if that counts toward fitness. It does not. What does it count toward? Hmm, okay. It's just Ellie having a good time. Oh, look, a fish. Where's John? John's fishing. He's going to go to the pier. I was hoping Eliza could go with him. This is his first attempt at fishing, and we are not making any serious commitment to fishing. Just thought it would be fun. Okay, Ellie is uh, suffering in some way. She's got to use the restroom and take a shower, so it's back to the bungalow with her. Where's the bungalow? How do we get twisted around? Okay, here we go. So, Ellie's got to go to the bathroom. And she also has to bathe, so we'll get her taking a nice bath with soaks. Muscle relaxing soak, rose petals soak, citrus soak, lavender soak, and milk, honey, and oatmeal soak. I think a muscle relaxing soak is the way to go. Got to get her out of that uh, boat. She's feeling energized, so she, if she can take care of some basic needs, she should be good to go for a while. And John is doing fine. Oh, okay, he caught fish. I don't care. John's doing fine fishing. Ellie is bringing the rigger around so she can jump out and go to the bathroom. Good job, Ellie. You know, I wasn't sure about these ladders at first, but I'm really enjoying that it's the primary way the Sims get back and forth in and out of these bungalows. I think it's a lot of fun. And I think that was Bella needing to use the facilities. Good. I've got Ellie going downstairs, so I'm not very concerned about Bella being in the bathroom and this is the guy who works here the maid and so he's going to clean up the stray plates and dishes and all that stuff he's going to clean up okay John should still be fishing good he's having a good time doing the fishing And just to keep us honest, John is a level seven mixologist and Ellie is a level six on the fitness scale. And so since Ellie, there are lots of things that Ellie can do and not very many things that John can do to build skills, I'm gonna focus primarily on Ellie for this vacation. And I wanted her to take a bath, but I think she wants to take a bath in the fancier tub, which I understand, except that Bella's in there and I don't know if she's going to be able to bathe in there. Get out, Bella. All right. Good. So, Ellie is good to go. And John is fishing. And he leveled up in fishing. So, I don't want him to fish for the rest of his life. I do want him... What is that? Okay. I do want him to travel to the bar... And I think it'll be some, a nice time to travel with his brother, just his brother, so I don't have so many people to consider. Okay, Bart and John are at the bar, having a good time, and I'm going to see if I can get some interactions with the bartender so that John can up his skills. So let's greet the bartender and just have a chat. Oh, John's singing? Okay, they're having fun. Hmm. 
Okay, sometimes you can have... Let's take a picture of John. Alright. A little bro time. <laughs> Alright. That's a good picture. Okay, John's trying to in, trying to interact with the bartender, and it's happy hour, so the drinks are cheaper. That's cool. John, being the guy who kind of looks like the guy with his fans, can order drinks for everybody. What's he gonna order? Okay, a lot of chocolate. Good, so he's gonna get some career advice from this guy whose name is Fetu. Fetu's a mixologist. John's trying to level up in mixology. So. I'm just going to try to get some insider info from this guy. Talk about drink making. Okay. Ah, now they're talking shop. And she's playing with Clay and talking to that lady there with the pretty braid. Let's talk more shop. Alright, there's an outside bar, so I'm going to get John to practice making, oh, practice bar tricks here, and that way he can build his skills. I think this place is closing. It's not that late. Hey, there's a servo, and it's broken. Hmm. Alright, where's Bart? And who's this lady? Oh, she's part of the Punchline Club. I guess that's the comedy club. Good. John has to go to the bathroom. It's not urgent, so I'm not going to worry a lot about it. But he's also going to mix some drinks. And I'm curious about what's going on with this servo. Oh, somebody better fix that. Can I help in some way? Could call for a repair. I mean, I hope that helps. All right, here's Sean, making drinks. All right, well done. Remember when John couldn't get the ice to stay in the glass and now he can stack three bottles tall? That's fantastic. He should make a drink for his brother. All right, he's inspired. John's having a good time here at the outdoor bar. He can make a drink for everyone, practicing his skills out here, and he's now able to make a sour punch. So let's get him on that level seven drink. Focus, John. All right, he's really gotta go to the bathroom. So let's use the toilet and then get back to that. Okay, John's going to the bathroom. This is a good place to end this episode. Thank you so much for joining me on the Switchbacks Sulani vacation. This has been a lot of fun for me. I hope it's been a lot of fun for you. I really am trying to make it a great experience for you, me, John, Ellie, and the whole Switchback family. So come on back and see how this vacation wraps up. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.